Magandang araw, uh, ako si Dr. Elmer Soriano from Ayala Foundation Access Health International at kasama natin si Dr. Lizelle Lagrada uh, from PhilHealth. We are now at PhilHealth and Dr. Lagrada is here with us to tell us about the primary care benefit package of PhilHealth. Uh, Dr. Lizelle is the uh, Senior Manager for Accreditation and Standards and Monitoring and she oversees the primary care and MDG teams of field health. Right. So can you tell us about the uh, primary care benefit package of field health? Uh, the, our primary care benefit is a really an uh, enhanced uh, outpatient benefit that we had since 2000 in mm -hmm. field health. No? We essentially in, uh, included the same services that we had in the outpatient benefit. That includes um, consultation, counseling on lifestyle and uh, li lifestyle uh, changes, and uh, cancer prevention. That includes uh, smoking cessation. We also have um, basic uh, cl uh, clinical examination or laboratory exams, no? and assurance that the medication for four diseases, asthma, uh, diarrhea, uh, uri uh, urinary tract infection, and pneumonia are available at the primary health care provider mm -hmm. no? services. We included uh, two additional ones, we the lipid profile and the fasting blood sugar. So these are critical uh, in, in the future developments under this benefit. Uh, people just don't know where to go mm -hmm. and what to expect mm -hmm. and what to do when they get ill. So another uh, change that we introduced is that members who are entitled to this benefit are actually assigned to a provider. Mm -hmm. The assignment is renewed every year. Mm -hmm. Why is this critical? Because one, we need to establish the relationship between the clientele or the client and the provider mm -hmm. because the, the primary care benefit works best you know, if uh, health education, health promotion is established and that cannot be done if the entitled member goes only to her doctor or to his doctor when they feel the, ill. No? Mm -hmm. So, kahit walang sakit, dapat alam nila na meron silang makakausap kung may tanong sila when they feel ill, when they get sick, alam din nila kung saan sila magtatanong kung saan sila magtatanong. So that's basically gatekeeping. Mm -hmm. For covered members naman, uh, bilang miyembro ngayon ng, ng PhilHealth, may ID na ako, ano ngayon? Ngayon para ano itong PCB para, PCB1 uh -oh. para sa atin? Kung sila ay sponsored member, sila ay click and roll through an organized group mm -hmm. click and roll men mechanism no? or they are dependents of OFWs mm -hmm. or members of field health then they are entitled to a set of services under the uh, primary care benefit package now for uh, those identified through the NHTS no? uh, may memorandum si Secretary Ona na sila ay naka-assign sa health centers or RHUs ng bayan at mga cities. Mm -hmm. uh, the, but for those other sponsored members no, that in the sponsor ni governor or ni mayor, mm -hmm. depende kung saan sila i-assign na sponsor sa kanila. Pero may assignment pa rin sa iyo. So kung member ako, na covered ako dito, meron clinic na dapat alam ko na yun yung pupunan ko? Yes. So kung pumunta ako sa assigned clinic, Papakita ko yung ID ko, titignan na sa listahan, makita nila yung pangalan ko. Yes. Tapos, uh, meron na akong uh, package of services na pwede ma- Yes. Uh, so, kung member ako, dapat alamin ko kung saan yun. Alam dapat ng yes. asawa ko at saka mga anak ko para uh, uh, tama yung mapuntan namin. Tama. At sa isang taon, kung ikaw ay membro, uh, payagan mo na yung provider mo ay i-profile ka, i-punin na yung health profile. So, yung mga history mo, mm -hmm medical history mo, may, may susulat, no? tapos yung mga problema mo pakalusugan, kasama na yung impact po, pamilya, kailangan nagka-record yan para makilala nila yung, yung pakalusugang status. 
So, kahit na wala akong naramdaman, dapat magpakita. Yes, doon. at least once. Please so, once. ibig sabihin, ang sinabi ni President Aquino sa sona niya nung, mga laka, nung nakaraang taon, no? Na namamatay ang mga Pilipino na hindi nakakakita ng doktor, hindi na mangyayari under primary care benefit one of like I'll get to. So, ito sa mga mahihikap nating kamiyembro at sa ating mga OFWs and organized group members, then uh, hindi na totoo na hindi ka nakita ng doktor sa doon na isang taon. Ano yung summary ng ano, uh, PCB package na gusto nyo ni parating sa kanila? Para po sa, sa ating lahat, no, ang primary care benefit package po ang magiging daan natin para sa malusod na pamunuhay. Dahil hindi natin kailang maghintay na tayo magkasakit sa primary care benefit na tutugunan na yung ating uh, uh, pangangailangan pangkalusugan. So essentially, ito ay para makaiwas sa sakit. Pangalawa, kung meron naman tayong mga sakit na hindi pa naman malupa, yung mga common na sakit tulad nga ng pagtatae o uh, ubot sipon no? o kaya infection sa ihi eh, o hika matutugunan naman ito dahil may assurance na may mga pangunahing gamot para sa mga sakit na ito na available sa ating health provider. Maraming salamat po. Uh, muli ako si Dr. Elmer Soyano ng Ayala Foundation Access Health International at kasama natin si Dr. Lizelle Lagrado of PhilHealth. <music>